Hey, we got some new shows coming. We going to Corpus Christi, Texas. New Orleans. We going to Edmonton, Canada. Calgary, Canada. Spokane, Washington. Tacoma, Washington. Vancouver, Canada. And Irvine, Brand, San Diego. Yeah, we coming back to California. Go to hogstwinstore.com for tickets. Yeah, I'm a looking. Yeah. That was clean. There's a lot of black people up in New York upset. There's been another unarmed black man shot and killed. There were tense moments following the shooting. Witnesses turned their anger towards the NYPD, calling the incident murder. Residents say Vassal is well known in the neighborhood. They claim he has mental health problems, but say he wouldn't hurt anyone. People knows him as a neighborhood guy. This is just walking around saying, Hi, I want to go to church with you. Can I sweep? Can I clean up for you? That's the kind of guy he was. Harmless, harmless, totally harmless. Which is sad, man. Yeah, but anybody lose their life over some stupid shit, man. Yeah, but what turned what happened was, but what turns out what happened was. Yeah, tell them what happened, man. Tell them, the, tell them everything, all the dirty details that led up to this tragic event, man. Yeah, I mean he wasn't just walking down the street. Cops jumped out the car and blew his, killed him. It didn't happen like this. This is what happened. Yeah. The man was walking down the street holding something what appeared to be a gun and he was pointing it at people acting like he was going to blow their brains out. There's actual footage of this. That's not cool, man. That's not Can cool. Can you imagine how scared these people was? Yeah, he actually did it against somebody that was, had a little kid with him. So it was three 911 calls that went into the police department. Pretty much said, nigga got a gun out here. Yeah, it's a dude out here with a gun. So then the cops show up. As soon as the cops show up, hit the guy with the... What appears to be a gun takes a stance like he's going to shoot the cops. Cops shoot and kill him. Yeah. Now, what do y'all expect? There's a reason why I don't walk down the street holding something look like a gun and I start pointing at people. Yeah, well, who would do that? Well, he was bipolar. Oh, yeah, that's right. But who right. knows if he's bipolar? Who knows if he's got a real gun? Yeah. So if you put yourself in harm's way, it's quite possibly something's going to happen to you. And that's what unfortunately happened to this dude. You can't blame the cops for this. Cops... Yeah, you got a split decision as a cop, man. Yeah. I mean, what are the cops supposed to do, man? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, what? Oh, wait, oh he might have a gun. What is that? Is, yeah. that? is that a gun? Wait a minute. Bow! Can't, you can't, you can't, you can't do that, man. You can't ask a cop to do that. Yeah, cop got man. kids and family just like this dude had. Yeah. They they risking their life, life on a daily basis yeah. protecting the city. Yeah, so you can't, you can't blame the cops. Yeah, man. Can't blame the cops, man. Can't, can't man. Can't do it, man. What's up, man? Man, what's that smell? <laughs> <laughs> you nasty mother. What's up, everybody? How am I looking? Uh, 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 uh. Tired of this email. It smells like ass in here. <laughs> Tired of this email, boyfriend is an addict. Yep, time to pack your shit and leave. Hey, damn, if I would come to the house, my damn girl's a crackhead, man. I ain't putting up with that shit. I ain't not putting it. Life is too short for some bullshit. You come home, girl's strung out on drugs? Man, fuck all that. Who I, wants to put up with that shit? You made, you made a decision to ruin your life by taking drugs. Bitch, I gotta go. You sit here and do the rest of them lines you got chopped up. I'm gonna go find me a real woman. 